In this tutorial, I'll show you how we can create this custom cursor in your WordPress website by using Elementor. So I'll show you how we can make 5 different kinds of custom cursor, how we can also change its color, and here you can see, when you click anywhere on your page, it also makes this kind of smooth clicking effect. That's cool. So without further ado, let's see how can we create that. So to achieve this effect, basically we need to add a small JavaScript code. So if you go to any of our page, here if we take an HTML widget and inside this, we can just paste that code. But in that case, we need to add this custom code for all of our pages. So I don't need to do that in that way. So let's delete this HTML widget from here. And if you go back to our dashboard, from this Elementor, we need to just go to this custom code option and I want to write our code from here. So let's click on this add new button here and let's name it to custom cursor and I want to add this code at the very bottom of our body tag. So let's select this and let's just paste this code to here. Let's save this and I want to add this for my entire website. So let's keep it to intersite and click on save and close. Now if you go to our page, here we can see this nice smooth animation and this custom circle is following with our mouse cursor. That's cool. And it's not only applied for our this page, if we go to our another page, you can see it's also perfectly applying for our this page. And by the way, here on this page you can see this cool hover effect. So if you want to get this kind of cool and creative thing, you can also get all of this from my Gumroad shop. And here you can get those animations as ready-made template. So you just need to import that inside your Elementor page. Alright, now here let's take a look at these options. So from this type option, you can select 5 different types of cursor. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So if I set here 2. Now we can see a different kind of cursor, which also looks beautiful, okay? And then here is an, another option, remove default cursor. So if you want to remove your default cursor, you can also make it to true. Okay, now we can see our default cursor has been removed. So here is the last option, which is color. So you can see a hex code color, which is now set to black. So if you have a dark background website, in that case, you can also use a light color. Now let's say I want to use here a blue color. So I just want to go to any color picker option inside the Elementor. So here on this color picker option, let's select this blue color. And I just want to copy this hex code from here. And I don't need to use it on here. So let's clear this and go back again to here and just paste. Now you can see it changes to that blue color. So that's how you can create this custom cursor in your Elementor website. If you enjoyed this tutorial, then don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on my next video.